What's going on, Clutch? Squat! What up, what up, what up? It's your boy, Duck. It's your boy, Ross. We're in the Clutch. Hey. hey. Back to you, ladies and gentlemen, another visit today. You feel me? Back with some new, uh, best news, uh, bloopers, 2024, so, so far, far. Man. You feel me? We're about to get into this video right mm -hmm. now, man. Make sure you run with those likes, subscribe. Let's get into this mug as you know it. Yeah, let's do it, man. Before we get into it, we do want to shout out DraftKings for sponsoring today's video. Most definitely. Hey, summertime is upon us right now, so what better way to get you some extra cash than signing up for the DraftKings Casino? And also, for all the new players out there, all you have to do is play $1 and you get $100 in casino cash credits instantly. Can't beat that. Just $1. And guess, your favorite real money casino games right at your fingertips? We're talking choosing over 300 real money games like slots, mm -hmm. you got blackjack, roulette, live dealer games as well, whenever you want. With more real money games added regularly, DraftKings Casino is changing the game with new ways to play. Wide selection of exclusive DraftKings slots and blackjack games you can't find anywhere else. Hey, DraftKings Casino has awarded over $100 million Ooh. in jackpot wins. You did hear me correctly. Big time <laughs> jackpots for explosive wins all summer long. DraftKings is safe, secure, and reliable. If DraftKings uh, Casino isn't yet available in your state, check out DraftKings Daily Fantasy app, where you have a shot at winning cash prizes all season long. Hey man, look, I don't even know when you guys are still here waiting. Again, new players, go check it out right now. Head over to DraftKings Casino app right now. Do it. Again, sign up promo code is clutch ENT. You mm -hmm. see it down below. Play just one dollar and instantly receive a hundred dollars in casino credits. Plus, you can come back weekly for your own blockbuster bonuses. Easy. Man, look, I don't know about you guys, but we're gonna go check it out. Shout out to DraftKings again. Hope you guys enjoy it. Peace. Peace. And let's go. A news be funny. Pickleball. Hey. Hey yo. Baby spinach. Hitting boys like that, man. Hey man, that's how hey, cut them cameras off. Right. Hold on, man. Be a problem in here, let's, man. let's talk. Let's talk. Big Bounce America. All of this and more. Oh, oh. Now. So you do want to maybe drag your kittens into the, your Box. mittens into the car. So make sure to protect those pants or plants, uh, pets, and pipes. I was just like, um, like America doesn't just run on Dunkin' cars do too. As caffeine level. America does. <laughs> He was wait. That was his moment. That was. That was his moment, man. <laughs> he became somebody that day. Yeah, he did. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Start to rise. It's another morning for morning anchor Jimmy Marlowe. Good morning. I'm Deja Jones. And I am Deja Jones. Yes, big game going down tonight. Uh, thanks so much for You're tuning Deja in. You're Deja Jones. Oh, right. My like, bad. Boy just went with <laughs> I definitely it. just Ron burgundy it just now. Wow. I'm Jimmy. I'm Marlo. Deja Jones, That's too. That's wild. What's it like to be Deja Jones? That energy drink is hitting me. Yeah. <laughs> I told you to I throw it away. I'm Deja, wow. Deja Jones, um, too. <laughs> so who are we going to send it to? Monica, Jimmy, let, let, Jenna? I don't know. You go ahead and send it to whoever. <laughs> okay, get it says right. Monica Cryan is here okay. with a look at our <laughs> forecast. Hey, Deja. <laughs> and if you're thinking about driving today, be prepared and stay cautious. Yeah, baby, oh. It's uh, coming down pretty oh. happy. We'll say tonight. That dog was giving her the blues, man. <laughs> I would have been pissed. Bring your ass back here, man. Tonight's one of the Conservative Party's most prominent MPs from the 2019 intake, Lee Anderson, defects to Reform UK. He's one of the last pricks in the whole oh, so-called oh. Tory Red Wall just crumbled away. Tomorrow's right in the butt. What? No. That is hilarious. <laughs> I gotta say, I love his just pause and no. his... Yeah. No. I'm trying to figure out how you even get no. that on the first one. Meanwhile, right in, in the, the world butt. of What's Up with Ended Megan, with momentous and very different events you know are happening. <laughs> the police and fire charity game. And it's funny because he's like, uh, no. No, it. Like, no. <laughs> <laughs> no, what was on his mind? No, nigga. No. Right in the butt. Why would they will take place Why? Oh, at what, the no. Mountain View Arena this Saturday at 2 p.m. Central. Cheers for the guns or the hose, the hoses. This benefit <laughs> benefiting local organizations. Hey. <laughs> They're not hoes. Oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> what a Monday yeah. this Wednesday has been. And that's it. <laughs> what a Monday this <laughs> Wednesday. Mm -hmm. We will have those. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Welcome back, Megan. Happy to be back. <laughs> I love it. Temperatures really take a tumble, too, because after the storm, um, this is baby spinach. 
All this right. is not the storm, but this is baby spinach. But that, that's what I'm talking about there. <laughs> <laughs> after the storm, you could have Somebody some baby spinach. Trouble. I mean, why Man, not? It's kind of cold uh, up there. But this. it's going to be cold, Jeez. as you can see in your 10 day forecast. <laughs> this is baby nuts. spinach. You can eat some nuts. No, I, lo- I ate some nuts this morning. Yeah. Uh-huh. <laughs> it was only uh-huh. three. Uh-huh. <laughs> why they, why they, both looked at, they both looked at him like. Because he, he made a little, little chuckle. <laughs> I definitely would have been like, ooh. Did you really? Mm. What kind of nuts were they? It's only three. How much? I'm not doing nothing. Yeah. How much yeah. was it? How three. much? So it wasn't worth it? No. Mm. The nuts were not worth it. No more oh. nuts. No more nuts for me either. Then. Okay. Damn. Well, we, had, we had an eventful afternoon, you and I. <laughs> Did she dab <laughs> some? So Damn, I haven't seen I'm a so dab sorry. in a minute. She hit the. Let's go to she <laughs> hit that shit. <laughs> that was just oh, me. that's good. Take that a look was me outside. To me. <laughs> yeah, that was her. Yeah. I'm, I'm sorry. To <laughs> For Ryan Armani, it's already been a successful morning, but things are about to get even better. It's caught up on some news now. A suspected vandal facing charges after allegedly leaving Beavis and Butthead graffiti all over Detroit. Wow. My goodness. <laughs> what? Graffiti resembling me. I was was not. (laughs) (laughs) Why? What is going on? He got arrested for that. Bro, what's he doing that? Brian Heron calls himself Beavis. Uh, Spelled B V I S. I'm so sorry. (laughs) Dog, that is the wildest thing. Police say he left his mark on buildings and fences. Even inside a supermarket. Heron, actually, this is. <laughs> like, why? You have to pedal the peacock, right? That's EA? crazy. Say that again, Tanya. I'm you sorry. Pedal, you pedal the peacock. It's not, there's no motor to it, right? Yeah, you pedal it. I thought uh, you said you pet it. I was like, work. that can't be right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <you laughs> pedal it. He did pet it, though. He, he did. Pet in the pedal and the peacock, and there we go. T.A. Walker. And there's that delay, so they're like, yeah. you do it. You're out, Tanya. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Three. Let's see if we get Marley. Marley. Two. Oh. 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 Hell no. <laughs> Me and Marlo will be throwing hands. I'm not even going to hold you. Hey, bro. Stop spitting on me, man. That this nigga walking up time. just. <laughs> Hot to <laughs> over and over and over on you. Yeah. Stop llama, llama no more. Hey, you gonna stop that shit. You gonna go to the llama pearly gates. Exactly. Stop it. I'm trying but to do a show. Passing, we learn more about hey. Hot Tua. Oh, oh, catching him, dog. Look. He covered you on that one. Yeah, he did. <laughs> bro, he's just a disrespect with it, bro. He just walking up to him just. And it's a black one. The yeah, white one chilling with the black one. I don't like you. I don't like you at all, you mother. It's just, it's just something about your glasses in here. You, you look like a nerd. I don't like you. You look spittable. Look at him. All right, we'll do one more. Reporting from downtown, James Schaefer. Fuck you. That was nice. Eight News Now. Oh, okay. Oh, okay, you hit him. We got, and Brighton, Mark we got Anderson, him. News 10. Right. Uh, what? <sighs> Oh, Anderson, Lord. News 10. Ah. Why that? Uh. Oh! Oh. Oh. <laughs> Couldn't even stop to help. Meanwhile, back in Detroit, Marielle Lou has got something she's happy to share with Dina Centifanti. Dina Producer Santa Aaron's mom made oh, yeah. wonderful, Beautiful. wonderful cookies, little hearts, and bow and arrows. And I just grabbed a couple of the arrows. I see. And uh, I gobbled the first one up. Hey, ha, ha. fast. Yeah. Oh, so, I, bet. It's so I saved one for you. Thank you. All right. All right. <laughs> well, you can't give it to her now. You touched it. Well, she can have this one. Okay. What kind of presentation is this? So you can't By give the it way, to her thank now, you, you to Aaron's it. mom, who she, she makes the great most delicious, baked, yes. delicious cookies. sugar cookies. Yeah. Um. it up, huh? <laughs> All yours, Dina. I'm just gonna so, sit over here in the dude section. You. Yeah. What happened to the heart? Yeah. Heart shaped ones. Yeah. <laughs> I 
Yeah. <laughs> so you just have the arrow. I'm up for the keeping for a stupid cookie okay. all of a sudden. Do you want a bite of this one? No, I'm good. I am totally Are you good. sure? I'm good. You don't I already bite had this? some sweets ah. this morning. Because, it, yep. because the arrow goes through the heart. Yes, yeah. it does. Yeah, I bet. <laughs> yes, it does. <laughs> I bet. <laughs> Anyway, yeah, I'm going to eat this later. Yeah. Put that right there. Yeah. Thank you. Sure, later. Are you sure? Yeah, take, take Thank you. Home. You Thank can you. just, probably just two bites. Yeah. Oh, boy. Oh. <laughs> um. All right, lady. Two bite gobbler over there. Oh. Get it. Oh. Get it. Get it. Pause. She wanted to be known. <laughs> two bites. She said I had some earlier. <laughs> Wait a minute. You notice something? His hands don't match. Maybe he's blackface. That has to be a severe tan. I I, I don't know. If it or just or vitiligo. It could be that too. It could be that too. I don't know. Or so, blackface. I don't know about that either. But we'll see the <laughs> right now. I'm gonna go have some fun. Yeah. See? A bite out yeah, of it his now. Hand. Thank, Thank you. You, you Thank can you. just probably just two bites. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> right now, I'm gonna go have some fun. Uh, Deja, Jimmy, you guys, uh, if you want to leave the office, turn the studio lights on. Come on ahead this way. I'm going up. I'll see you guys in a little bit. Okay. All right. Oh, I kind of want to see something. the outcome of this, Tyrone. I kind of want to see like a. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> what just ended it? Okay. I'm okay. Oh, okay. I'm okay. Thank goodness for that. All right. Jephthah was just flopping all over the place. Want to serve it on up to Joe. Joe, it was a golden night oh, no. for Hollywood as the Golden Globes were handed no, out. But Joe, it. you say not everyone had a shining moment. Oh, oh. I didn't mean to oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. I just thought. Yeah, I got up and we <laughs> served some hands. <laughs> we moved some furniture yeah, around to, to have a real. Real where did, match. Where did you think it was gonna go? You saying you didn't mean to, just but bonked him right in the face. Just bah. <laughs> like you just showing had a shining he just moment. There too. Look. Oh, bah. I didn't mean to hit you. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. I just thought I was gonna go over you. I'm so sorry. Over to Joe. Are you okay? No. <laughs> no. I'm so sorry. Beat your ass. Uh, Joe, I'm so sorry, dude. I'm suing him. <laughs> Talk to T and a gurney when we come back. Well, I choked. I was choking on a banana a couple of years ago. Remember I told you? <laughs> I, can't, I kid you wow. not. Captain Awesome right. saved my life. Wow. Seriously. Damn, they laughing. <laughs> I mean, I, 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 folks, I couldn't make this up if I had to. 67 degrees you right now. You have to go roll past In Denton. <laughs> They were cloudy rolling. skies right now. We have 67 <laughs> degrees. It's 60, 68 at uh, Dallas Baptist University. But it turns oh out God. that Cynthia Isaguirre oh, isn't the Houston. only one with the banana uh -oh. problem to grapple with. Uh -oh. Much to Maggie Fleckno's frustration, it's launch day for the Trader Joe's banana price increase. I'm here for this because I am. I postponed my errands. Mm -hmm. I actually am going in TJ's. I'm gonna. I'm gonna give him a dirty look. You should. I am. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. oh. I am. What right laugh now, is that? we are tracking falling bananas from the sky, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> it's cloudy with a chance of banana. Hey, yo. Whoa. <laughs> the Good current up, conditions outside. 53 degrees winds from the north at 14 wind. miles per hour. Maggie, this is yeah, what I wanted to, to bring you through, through, though, it's here on our future cast. It's going to be early this year. <laughs> oh, we're giving up this at year. this yeah. point. <laughs> is anybody paying attention <laughs> to the forecast? Oh, my God. <laughs> She's crying, everybody. There's a banana thing. Look, there is a banana. This is why. That is what Maggie what launched at me. <laughs> I didn't mean oh, to. Yeah. I was old. Nothing else to see here. Like yeah, I'm just checking my phone for the updates, bro. Yep, yeah, we're laughing about bananas on TV. I'm oh. just trying to see if I can go outside and go to this. Yeah, go to the park today, and you guys are going in on the banana. We get it. Thank it you. was funny. Ah, ha, ha. thank you. Oh no! <laughs> I dropped it. Maggie's losing it this morning. No, Everybody, I'm not. get her it off the, the screen. You guys, this was spontaneous <laughs> live TV. Okay. Claudio and I practice. You get guys remember here. when get we caught a football live? <sighs> My banana's breaking. 
<laughs> this is how I feel yeah, after yeah. a long week. I don't know what okay. to do now. <laughs> is it time for break? <laughs> how about I, I just get my prompto <laughs> in my pocket because I have smushed banana on my face. I'm just going to ignore what's happening on the floor. It's sunny, y'all. It's sunny, sunny great day. Go get your produce. Back to you. <laughs> Back to yourself. All right. Back yeah. to yourself. What? I don't have my prompto. Wait, Stan. Stand by. Lucy, we're going to break. Somebody give me a mop. Don't step on it. Jeez Louise, it's like dog poo poo. Don't step on the banana. All right, you guys. This is a real thing on live the television. There might be rain keep tomorrow. This all in. You know, you got to keep moving. Uh, are there any men in there? I think They're I only all. saw one man and like 25 yeah. women. That is a lucky guy right there. They're all dead. <laughs> oh, no. Is that what you see? Did he say they're all dead? Oh, wow. He said that on live television? I don't know. If, I think that his intrusive thoughts got the best of him there. I mean, damn, damn bro. Oh. Well, I know, but you don't have to say Mathematically it. Mathematically speaking. Ooh. Mathematically. Maybe they just didn't want to dance to Taylor's <laughs> Yeah, no, they're gone. No, they're, they're, they're gone. gone. They're gone. <laughs> don't tell Aaliyah. Oh, You're okay. making her sad. Sorry. Oh. Sorry, but Sorry. they're gone. Me and Gumber and the old folks home someday. <laughs> no, y'all gonna be there. Yeah, we did. <laughs> so. Pete's got four words for you tonight. Well, at least it's not a four-letter word. <laughs> so what are the four words? Widespread soaking rain. Widespread is one word. Gosh, widespread. <laughs> uh -oh. oh, that's three. You see? Yo, no. Joe. I keep telling her if she if she she'll finally we need her to graduate from school. Cooked. And if she does. It's not hyphenated, that's right, it's one word. Hey, this is coming from the former uh, champion spelling of the spelling bee. Second Man, grade. there's so many things I could say, but I, I love your, I, I love her family, so I won't go there. Let me show you this. Now, you what go kind cooker. of toys do adults buy? We're talking here about trading cards, Lego sets, toys. sports toys. Oh. It's like right. sporting goods, most sought after. The reason why, the study credits the COVID-19 pandemic saying adults wanted to reconnect with the toys that made them happy as kids during that time. Okay, they that derive a lot of joy from those toys that you've played with mm. as children, <laughs> building well Legos. And... Oh, mm. Yeah, I like the American Girl dolls. Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna cry. Or like ATVs, you know, like they're for dogs, yeah. like toys. Yeah, you know? right, those uh, kind of toys. Yeah, 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 yeah. those kind of toys. Big toys. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. Well, the trading cards are very popular and lots of money these days. I would never consider trading cards <laughs> toys. Like, no, yeah, you, Alex, never. I guess, I guess that counts. Oh no, it doesn't. But I, I've been to the, the bricks and minifig here. store right. in Franklin and, and there's a ton of kids there. Finally, as it was always going to be eventually, it's time for the BBC. <laughs> also here at Nottingham Trent University is my BBC News colleague, Nikki Schiller. Nikki, let's bring you in at this point. Tell us where you are. Damn! Damn! Got this boy brain. Why did they go in so close? They zoomed in on his thoughts. Let's see what you thinking. Let's uh, get in there. Let's get in there. Damn. Put them thoughts on display tonight. Jeez. Ross, uh, oh, I am BBC outside News. here at Nottingham Trent University. Cool, so thank you very much. Yes. So, what have you got up at the weekend? Anything exciting? Oh, well, my niece's surprise birthday party. Oh, that's so, lovely. Yeah, so that'll be nice. But not a fun. surprise if she's watching this. Oh, right. Goodness me, I've spoiled. <laughs> <laughs> Shh. Have a good weekend. Uh, Bye. Sh <laughs> Let me see what mom's doing on television tonight. I'm guaranteed she's not watching this. Touche. You're so, right. You're right. But it could be that one time. We're like, oh, let me see moms on TV. I'm not about to watch no BBC News. Do you see your mom on TV? Like, I, come on. If this your job, then... Yeah, it'd be like, like just a mom. random situation. Oh, mom back on TV and see what she's talking about. Just, you know, some random shit in there. That would be crazy. It, it'd be the one time. And <laughs> she, oh. what is, it's the niece, though. It's not even her mom. True. True, true, true. Right. But she well, spoiled it, nonetheless. Yeah. <laughs> to, to millions. <laughs> it went off. 
I'm just laughing. We're but... already being contacted by viewers watching the programme, but we want to know how bad it is where you oh, are, wow. and we will come and film some of the worst. How big is your hole? You, <laughs> you can tweet me <laughs> <laughs> at mcnorthatbbc.co.uk. If you can send a picture... Norton's always in a hole. Uh, if you can uh, tweet me a picture, that would be good as well. Uh, the tweet biggest <laughs> potholes. Uh, we'll be uh, having some of them on the programme. That's your business today. I'm Ty Gen Rice. See you next time. Bye-bye. All right. I went to sleep. I think he left before he even finished. He's like, all right, I'm done. I'm clocking out. It'd be fun to see their mistakes. Yeah. <clears throat> and I do love the weather. Hello. Hello. A very good evening to you. Well, it really was lovely to see okay. the sunshine today and uh, things are set to change as we head through the overnight period uh, as we see some... Oh, they're not on the right. They're not switching well. to the right the angle. The oh, no. Oh, no. 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 Scotland. Where are y'all hiring these people? People lying on their application. <laughs> Did it just sit there? Going for rain for eastern Scotland, stretching from Fife down to the borders area. Somebody Valid got from fired. from 9 a.m. tomorrow until uh, Thursday morning. But it will be the persistence of the rain that will be the issue, because the rain does ease from many places. Well, they're not the even showing the rain. The east has been dry for the south So they don't even know what the weather is. She knows. She see that. ain't nothing on the screen. Looking at 7 or 8 Celsius, but the easterly winds will make it feel cool, if she not committed cold. committed to. Into tomorrow evening, that rain does ease, leaving lots of dry weather with clear spells. Just a few spots of rain for the southeast. That clears away very quickly on Wednesday morning, then dry with plenty of sunshine, but a cold feel to the day pretty much across the board. Yeah, apologies. I think we seem to have a little bit of trouble with your weather yeah. there, but we heard yeah. your voice, even if we didn't see the pictures. <laughs> Thanks, <laughs> Judith. <laughs> yeah, apologies for that technical difficulty there. Charlie yeah. Nagger, thank you. Good morning. I'm Sean Peel. In the uh, local elections, it's been a bad night for the uh, Conservative... What's going on? Is that something that allows them to switch it? What the fuck? It's been a bad night for the Conservatives. They've lost more than 30 councillors across the six authorities where overnight counting took place. In Peterborough, which recently... it got to be something that allows yeah, them to switch. It, yeah. But it's not switching. Oh... In the paper, too. This is just so awkward. Oh. I do apologize. We seem to be having some problems this morning. Producer was <laughs> flaming in the back. Good morning. I'm. It is challenging. Okay. The Conservative Party is on life support. And someone's the recording this, so they're the watching polls, this. What we're hearing watched on the it live. And it's a hard job to make people come out and vote when they're so disillusioned with what's happening in Westminster. And that's been a real challenge. Well, if he's still clicking. Okay. <laughs> oh, oh, bro. That, uh, that's like just mega cringe, bro. Yeah, bro. Like, you just sitting on there. Damn. Seem to be having technical difficulties this morning. Hey, man. Hey, the BBC, y'all got to get it together, man. Yeah, nah, for sure. I seen those a few clips at the end there, man. <laughs> God doing, man. Dang it all, bro. Y'all got to hire these people, man. Get it together on the producing side, man. Sheesh. Know, wish LinkedIn or something that these people get these jobs from. Damn, man. But nah, man, if y'all enjoyed the video, I love checking out the best news mm -hmm. groupers, man. We get a kick out of it as usual. Uh, if y'all enjoyed it, make sure you run up the like, subscribe. Let us know in the comments down below. For sure. Which part was your favorite part? And if you want us to check out some more, continue as always to spread love <laughs> and be loved. I mean, <laughs> seem to be a couple technical difficulties. This is from Houston. If you got a problem, then we got the solutions. And there's no illusion. I made this shit happen. I'm living life lucid. I'm switching my strategies. Now they hate on me because I'm causing casualties. But why are they after me? Deep inside they know they can't handle half of me